you know, there's there's several things in that uh, comment uh, that will be relative for some other discussions down the road, like marketing and niches and all those kinds of things, because it's a very important thing to uh, realize. What I think I've seen in the consulting work I've done, uh, once people have opened up, I, I'm not talking about the business planning process, that uh, what we've kind of called the glorification of entrepreneurship. Uh, but uh, people seem to be afraid to spend the money to hire professional help. And I'm talking as much as anything about accountants uh, or accounting services as I am anything else. Uh, and the, the getting the reality of if you don't keep track of your sales and your dollars, uh, there's a lot of things that you don't know. Uh, one is what you're doing business-wise and what your expenses are. But the other is, is uh, are you making any money? Are you, you know, where, where, where is it going? Are you just spinning your wheels and really not getting paid for what you're doing? Uh, that I think is a, a very large weakness. Um, I think one of the others might be that it is very hard to listen to other people, particularly when they talk about critical things. And um, sometimes you just want to shake somebody. <laughs> uh, when, it, when you know when you talk and talk about things and it just doesn't seem to change so you know th those are things that i hired done and paid off by doing that uh the same thing's true about uh you know i tried the self self-help website for a long time and it didn't work because uh, mm -hmm. it was just there just wasn't enough time to do it so um the other thing that i find interesting though when people start to analyze their businesses this goes back to a tech trend and I, this is kind of one of those, as Vince calls, a rabbit hole. But, you know, I've been around a number of my, I would say my wife has, a number of folks who own, we'll call them boutiques, but no, they no longer have a storefront. Hmm. They are doing quite well just online in doing things like what we're doing here. And so hmm. uh, I guess my point is, is that when you begin to think about what's the best thing for you to do? There are many, many options out there that you need to explore. And what are your strengths? You know, do you, you know, what are your weaknesses? Can you do something radical? I think that's radical if you ever, for me as a retailer, I think that'd be radical. Uh, but, you know, it's, it's uh, just an interesting model for, you know, that people are looking at. So,